Welcome back to the channel guys. So because of this COVID-19 pandemic, all of our travel plans are cancelled. So today on a different note, we decided to share our experience of setting up our home gym as we think it might be useful for you guys also. Both me and Polami are hooked to fitness from the last year. But because of the pandemic, all the gyms are closed. Now gyms are going to reopen very soon, but still we won't be joining back until few more months. Hence, we decided to set up our home gym. After three to four months of investments, now we have all the things that we need for heavyweight lifting and also for cardio exercises. But let's start from the cheapest and the simplest setup and then we will move up to the more serious and the expensive gear. If you guys just want to start with the minimum investments, then go for the resistance bands. They are very cheap and is the most bang for your buck. You can attach these bands in various places to get the exact angle that you are looking for. Also the resistance bands come at various widths and more the width the more will be the resistance. So start with the thinnest to get going and then go for the more thick ones as per your need. I really like the resistance bands because they are portable and you can start exercising without any setup. You don't have to set up your dumbbells or barbells, just attach the bands to a door or any staircase railings to get started. I bought my 3 resistance bands for around 3000 rupees and I highly recommend it. Now guys, resistance bands are good but if you are really serious about bodybuilding, then the next progression is to invest on free weights to step up your fitness game. I recommend you guys to go for standard 26 to 31 mm plates from your local stores. You can get these weights very cheap at around Rs 80 per kg. Also I recommend to buy two 1 feet rods to make dumbbells and a 4 feet or a higher rod for barbell exercises. Also if you buy your weights in the combination of 1, 3, 5 and 10 kgs, then you can mix them up to get any kind of weight combination that you are looking for. So they are really useful in the long run. Also you can use the barbell rod to do pull ups. With resistance bands it's a bit hard to do certain exercises like the squat, deadlift, shrugs etc. But with dumbbells and barbells they become much easier. By the way guys if you are really enjoying this content then don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. But still guys the chest exercises are a bit hard to do with just dumbbells. So you can next invest on an incline bench. I bought mine for around 7000 rupees. And with the bench, I can perform all the popular chest exercises really well. Also, it's helpful to perform overhead presses, chest supported rows or skull crushers. Also guys, don't forget to buy some cushioning so that you can easily drop the weights without damaging your floor. Now guys, finally, if you are still not happy and you are missing your true gym experience, then you can choose to go all out. Now depending on your goals, you can either invest on a treadmill if you are looking for weight loss or a proper power cage or a squat track with Olympic weights. Treadmills are the best option for weight loss goals. I suggest you guys not to invest on a manual treadmill as they are really hard to exercise on. Instead go for a motorized treadmill. They cost starting from around 16,000. The one we bought costed us around 28,000. It has incline options. Also the maximum speed of the treadmill is 16 km per hour. And also the length of this treadmill is really long. Now guys, I don't do cardio much. I just run for around 5 minutes before starting my other lifts to warm up my body. But Polomi really loves the treadmill and she runs for around 10 to 15 minutes every day. And guys, I feel running is really important in this time because it increases our cardiovascular capacity, which in fact is going to help you to fight COVID as your heart is going to be capable of pumping more blood in case you get pneumonia or any other kind of breathing troubles. But guys, like I am no expert so this is just my opinion. And if your goals are more on the weightlifting side like myself, then go all out and buy a proper power cage or a squat track with Olympic barbell and weights. A power cage ensures your safety when lifting heavy weights. For example, when doing heavy bench presses or squats alone in your home, where there is nobody else to spot you, what will you do if you get stuck with the weights? You can seriously injure yourself. So it's a must to buy a power cage. It has the safety pins on the side which will help you to protect your safety in case you fail to lift the weight. I bought my weights from a company called Finecart and their products are really cheap compared to others. The power cages normally cost around 50 to 60,000 rupees but I bought it for just 18,000 and the quality is just awesome. Also the Olympic weights costed me around 190 rupees per kg that too with shipping. So yeah, I highly recommend the products from Finecart. 
that's it guys i hope all of this information is helpful for you and it will help you to make correct decisions while setting up your own home gym let me know if you have any suggestions or questions and don't forget to like share and subscribe